girls here? How many? Wait. How many girls here brought their boyfriends? Who brought their boyfriend tonight? Hi, you. You really didn't want to come to a Katy Perry show, did you? But you're a good boyfriend, right? You're a very good boyfriend. You knew it was going to make her very happy if you escorted her to the Katy Perry show. Yes. You know that if you go to the Katy Perry show, then after the Katy Perry show. It's a training game, you know? Come on, you come here and... I'm sorry, this is in all ages. You're a, nice, you're a nice guy, I can tell. You look like the nice guy kind of type. Don't fuck it up. Seriously, because there's, there's a breaking point in a woman. Like, we love you. We love you. When you love us back, we're like kittens. Cuddly kittens. And then when you break our hearts, we have the worst period you've ever experienced. <laughs> Don't break our fucking hearts. Um, sometimes when a boy breaks my heart, I say, okay, you want to break my heart? I'm going to write a song about you and the whole fucking world's going to sing along. You want to bump? Let's go. Let's go. So this next one goes out to, uh, to all of the ex-boyfriends we still have in our phones. Do, does anybody have their ex-boyfriend's number in their phone? Yeah. Of course, because who are we going to call when we get drunk, right? Because we're not, we are not going to call that new guy because we don't want him to know that we're crazy. <laughs> so this one, I think we should call up those ex-boyfriends. Yeah, come on, get your cell phones out. Let's call them up. Let's leave them a little voicemail message. <laughs> it's called You're So Gay. Yeah. 